Hello everyone, just a quick one here. I'm about ready to head out to film one of this week's episodes. My little brother Eric just finished beating Shenmue for the first time ever about a week ago, and I'm going to film part of my review with him over at my mom's place. That's going to be this week's episode, along with a look at some interesting Dreamcast and Sega Saturn memorabilia, including some Japanese magazines. Uh, getting ready to do that, and I just wanted to come up here quick and throw out, I just heard the news that Dragon Quest XI is now officially going to be coming out on the PS4 and the 3DS, and that by itself honestly wouldn't really excite me. I mean, as I like Dragon Quest, but I'm not a huge fan, and particularly with the track record of Square Enix over the past decade or so, they've been picking stuff back up and they're kind of trying to go back to their glory days, but... What really made me interested in this announcement is that it looks like Chunsoft is going to be handling the 3DS version of the game, and Level 5 is more than likely going to be handling the PS4 version of the game. And that really got me excited because Dragon Quest VIII, a Level 5 production, is not only my favorite Dragon Quest game of all time, but it's one of my top 25 games of all time. Fantastic game, absolutely love it. Level 5 is one of my favorite developers, and I really think this could really be a fantastic game. It's a great announcement because it kind of goes along with a, a little bit of a comment a couple of weeks ago made where they're saying the next Dragon Quest would definitely not be online. It would definitely be a single player console RPG and a return to turn-based combat. So that coupled with the level 5 involvement really has me excited. This could be a great release. Um, a little bit leery on the whole releasing on 3DS and PS4 at the same time because I'm not sure. It depends how they handle it. Either they're going to make the 3DS version be just sort of a toned down, simplified, lesser version that's just portable in the PS4 game, or I'm, what I'm hoping they're going to do, I'm going to hope that they're going to kind of go in a different direction with the two versions and just have the same game that plays a little differently and the 3DS version just be a little more reminiscent of a very classic RPG, while the PS4 version implements some greater technology and a bigger budget and implements a little bit more of some more modern gaming mechanics along with the classic. So hopefully if that PS4 version is a good balance and that 3DS is that great classic experience, I think tying that together would be the best way to go. But we'll see what happens. It's just been announced. I mean, this is definitely something that's going to be years away, so who knows. But real cool announcement. And yeah, I'm about to head out and see my brother, and I'll see you at the end of this week for a review of Shenmue.